beautiful. Oh my god, I love this one. You like that? Yeah. We are here to celebrate the special union between Allison and Michael, who have chosen to consecrate their love today in matrimony, and who have invited us to share in that love, joining with them as they weave their lives together in marriage. From the moment I first laid eyes on you on the res quad outside Houston Hall our freshman year at Tufts, I knew from that moment forward that our lives would be inextricably linked. Michael, if you had told me back in 2010, sitting in Houston Hall, fourth floor, that we'd be getting married sometime in the future, I'm not sure I would have believed it. Allison? Do you take Michael to be your husband? And Michael, do you take Allison to be your wife? Do you promise to honor, cherish, and protect him and love her forevermore? I do. I do. I promise to live joyfully with you, and I cannot wait to get started on this big adventure together. I love you, Allison. I promise to love you no matter what. I can't wait to be your wife, and I'm so excited for the rest of our lives together. And now, by the power vested in me, it is my honor and delight to pronounce you husband and wife. You may now kiss. Mike has been an unwavering and steadfast supporter of Allison's and her cheerleader in chief. It makes us so happy to see how much he lights up when he's with her and how much he cares for her. Allison, it's been a joy getting to know you over these past nine years. You're brilliant, creative, adventurous and kind, and perhaps most importantly, you're never afraid to put Mikey in his place. I genuinely appreciate the wonderful effect that he has on Allison, and we're just truly respect and adore the couple that they've become together. So Mike and Allison, my wish to you is that when you fight, may it only ever be over the Caps and Lightning playoff games. When you're frustrated, may only be over the lack of public transportation options. And when you fall, know that you'll always have each other to lean on. May you be blessed with a loving home filled with warmth and laughter and compassion. And may you never forget that it is what we give back, not what we get, that is the true measure of a life well lived. May your worries be less, your joys be more, and may nothing but happiness come through your door. All night.